Here we can see the workings of the Dinoric slate quarries, the cuttings into which were known as galleries, and on which a unique series of small 040 saddle tank steam engines worked for over a century. Today the slate is quarried mechanically and carried away by road, but many of the little steam engines have survived, and here we see a pair of them working out of the yards of the Dinoric quarries in the 21st century on the Hlamberis Lake Railway. At the Festiniogs Harbour Station in Porth Maddock, we see a recreation of the early form of motive power shunting some slate wagons during a special gala event. The railway had opened in 1836 to carry the slates from Blyna Festiniog down to the harbour at Port Maddock, as originally named after its founder, William Maddox, and used horsepower to drag empty trains to Festiniog, 13 and a half miles away, for nearly 30 years, until its first steam locomotive, Mountaineer, was delivered in 1863. Downhill trains ran under gravity, both when horses and then steam engines ruled. For now, we're going to see Quarry Hunsett's working freight trains on the Festiniog, and return later to experience slate traffic on the rails. Lilla is the Hunsett the Festiniog bought from the Barla Lake Railway in 1997, and is here working a short slate train up the line. Lilla was built in 1891 for the quarries of the Penryn Quarry Railway, which, like the Dunorwick, had smaller locomotives in the working quarries than were used on its main line. Thus, she's not actually an Alice-class engine, although she was built to the same Hunslet design. <laughs> 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 